was nine years old, it was just a dream that I had. Wow, I wish that I could work with the Muppets. Hi, this is Kevin Class from Sesame Street. How are you? Kevin is most comfortable when he is Elmo. Thank you for coming. Kiss, 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 kiss. <laughs> Elmo's happy now. He was in high school. He had guys that would pick on him, said he was playing with dolls. He faced a lot of opposition, but he just stuck with his dream. If the thing that people love about Elmo is he needs them, I attribute that to Kevin because of his embodiment of this character. He really does exemplify what Jim Henson began with, something that touched everyone. If everybody else your age is doing something very different to what you're doing, there's always going to be someone saying that you might not succeed, you might not make any money with that. All of those things will go away if you really focus on what makes you happy. <laughs> Welcome back. That was the trailer of the trailer. Yay! Of, woo, <laughs> of Being Elmo, A Puppeteer's Journey, rated PG, and it was made in 2011, a documentary, which is about an hour and a half. It um, stars Mr. Kevin Clash, Whoopi Goldberg. Whoopi Goldberg? Yep, From Whoopi. From Ghost? Ah, that yep. Whoopi? Whoopi, <laughs> yes. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, Mr. Frank Oz and director Constance Marks. Is that a real name? Um, I think so. <laughs> um, anyway, so let's just get into the reviews. Uh, Brian, what'd you think? Well, um, Wait, 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 wait. What's what? up, Joel? You stink. You don't Aww. have to be mean. No, no, really. You stink. I am not gonna say here. You gotta put some deodorant on or something. Dude, I put I am, deodorant on. I am not deodorant. doing this whole I review you, like this. Okay, <laughs> just cut. Really? Yeah, cut, oh it's cut. I'm done. <laughs> All right, so here we are. We had some issues, and we're just gonna do this up here now. Mm. So, <laughs> this is our. These are our puppets. And Brian, why don't you tell the people about you our notice puppets? Notice my beautiful hair, curliness. Um, thanks to you, though. I, I couldn't. I couldn't do this for the life of me. I'm a sower. Yeah, but it's awesome. I think. I like your puppet, like. I'll bake them up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When you were talking, you were like, oh, blah, yap, yap, yap. Ah. Oh, it's like the cookie monster. <laughs> and then I got my, uh, you can't see it, but there's a little Mario shirt, a little video game shirt. Zoom hey. right there. Hey, what, what's going on top there? Like, what? what's that stuff? Oh, that's just some hair there. So. Yeah, a little, no, a little, a little curly. Nor like. no, here, nor there. Uh, <laughs> review? Being Elmo. I loved it. Like, it, this is, like, watching a documentary like this makes me... You know, renews my love for documentaries because I can't. When I'm done with this, when I was done with this movie, I had a feeling I can't get from from any narrative movie. Like, I felt inspired as a person to go out in the world and just like pursue my dreams and just like ready to like do something. You know, that, you can't get that from a narrative, and I loved it. It was just this guy from New Jersey who who had this passion to do puppets, and even yeah. if he was made fun of, he just did it and made you know met the right people and created Elmo. <laughs> you know, yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> Um, I really, I really liked it. <laughs> I liked the movie a lot. Um, it was very uh, inspirational, like to watch and to see that, like, what you can do if you like, if you have a dream and you stick to that dream all your life. You know what you can accomplish. Mm -hmm. Like, just stick with it, man. And he did, even when he was getting teased in high school oh, yeah. and playing with puppets. Mm -hmm. Like, it's crazy. Yeah. Like. Mm -hmm. All the stuff that he, he, he had to go through to get to where he is, but now I know those people that teased him are like, I should have been nice. Like, I know, right? <laughs> you know, like dollars right oh, now, yeah. you know? So it, I, I really liked it. I had a good time. I watched it with my daughter. She kept her attention, yeah. too, for the most part. Mm -hmm. And it was cool to see the behind the scenes of everything. It's, I mean, like for, it's for everybody, really. It, it's a date movie, family fun movie, because it's only rated PG. There's nothing inappropriate in it, so mm -hmm. it's good for all audiences. I mean, it could be good for a date movie, because it's, it's a really good movie. Well done. Mm -hmm. It reminds me of, like, Rudy, actually. You know, I kind of expected like them the to... Football? The football yeah! movie? Yeah! Huh. Because it was, like, an the underdog, underdog movie. Uh -huh. You know, he's coming from, you know, bare bones, and he's going after his dream, and the odds are against him, and it, it, it was the same thing for me. So mm -hmm. for me, this was... It was a feel-good movie, and average size bowl of popcorn. I enjoyed it, and I also got to make a cool puppet. I know, right? All right, so I think I am going to go give it a five stars. Seriously, because seriously, because nice. there's nothing wrong with it. I felt like it did everything it was meant to meant to do. It was for, for the perfect audience. I felt like they hit every note right. You know, um, I'll give it. It just barely gets four stars. I think mm -hmm. you know. I really liked it. I'll never watch it again. Um, it was cool to see behind the scenes and everything. Yeah. But other than that, I mean, it's not like one of my favorite movies, but I really liked it. 
Mm -hmm. I would watch it again. I gotta give it four stars, not five, but it was a good movie. I didn't really find anything wrong with it. I'm glad your puppet agrees with me. <laughs> <laughs> All what right. Do you give it? Five nods. He gives it five nods. <laughs> oh, Lord. So. Anyway, so tune in next week when we watch. What, what are we watching next week? We're going to watch um, Undocumented. Undocumented. So we will see you next time. See you next Bye. Week. Bye. Bye. Hey everybody, if you got a movie for us to review, please hit us up at our Facebook or our Twitter and we'll put it on our list to review soon. Thanks.